Football fans and climate activists have bashed Real Madrid for taking 15-minute flights to and from Valladolid for their first La Liga tie after the World Cup. The Los Blancos traveled to Valladolid on Thursday ahead of the Friday fixture against the hosts that ended in a 2-1 win thanks to brace from Karim Benzema. Carlos Ancelotti's team flew on their custom $400 million at 380 jet. The giant plane emitted around 6.4 tons of CO2 over the 15-minute flight which is equivalent to what average person would emit if they lived for 1,595 years. While a commercial A380 plane the capacity of 525 emits about 75 grams of CO2 per passenger kilometer, which is slightly worse than regular car, the real Madrid jet was only flying with around 50 persons, making the load of carbon emissions 10 times more. Some fans were quick to note the contradiction of the club to show support for 100% carbon-neutral campaigns by using kits made with recycled materials, while at the same time taking 15-minute flights. The team could have alternatively taken a two-hour bus ride over the 162-kilometer trip, but chose the more convenient mode of travel. While taking the team bus to Valladolid could have been the better option in respect to climate change, it could have taken a toll on the player's fitness. Spending two hours on a bus could increase the risk of fatigue on the players, which can result in high likelihood of injuries. With the players expected to perform at their top levels, that's why football clubs prefer having their teams take flights on every possible trip. Real Madrid is not the only club to get slammed for taking lazy flights. In September last year, PSB were too criticized when they took a plane to Nantes, which is a 384 kilometer from Paris, when they could have traveled in a two-hour high-speed train.